We've been invited here today to witness and share in the miraculous power of love. The ability and desire for one human being to love another is perhaps the most precious and fulfilling gift entrusted to us. It's an all-consuming task, a lifelong endeavor, the journey we've been preparing for for all of our lives. Loving someone is a reason to stretch beyond ourselves, to become more for the sake of the other. Loving is the ultimate commitment which challenges human beings to come, become all that they are meant to be. And as they join in marriage today, Davis and Kristen are announcing to the world that they are welcoming that commitment and that challenge of love. You have been invited to share in their joy because of your bonds to the bride and groom and their families. And again, they welcome you and thank you for coming. This is such a gorgeous wedding, but you know, we really aren't surprised because when we were playing kick the can outside and riding our scooters, Kristen was planning her wedding. At age five, she was picking flowers and convincing the neighborhood kids to attend the ceremony of the week. We've come a long way since Zell Lane, but Kristen, your experience shows. I think Kristen and I have been planning this day since we met each other freshman year. <laughs> I think freshman year we would sit on Pinterest and plan down every little detail of her wedding, just like every girl does. And I think Kristen has always known she's wanted a fall wedding with burgundy colors and gold accents. But the one thing we were missing was who exactly the groom would be. And thankfully it's Davis, <laughs> and I'm so happy it is. And then look back, David. Yeah. Yeah, look back. Now everything in the world is yours. Because when I met you, I met a universe. I want to be your morning light. It's warm. Mine's cold. One Saturday morning, Davis is cleaning the kitchen, and this is a new development in our relationship. And uh, I ask him why he's cleaning the kitchen, and he says, because Kristen's coming over. And so get you a girl or a guy who makes you want to clean the kitchen. That's what, that's what Davis and Kristen have taught me. Kristen, I give this ring on the side of my vow. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I honor you. I honor you. Davis. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a sign of my vow. As a sign of my vow. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And the Son. And the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Davis, you may kiss your bride.
I now present to you, for the very first time, Mr. and Miss Frank Davis Evans. Like when I close my eyes and don't even care if anyone sees me dancing like I can. 